Jasmine here, aka JOS, and today it is another um, unboxing. It's related to the BB uh, airsoft and BB guns. And if you didn't know, on the third of February, I'll be playing in a match in the field. This is my first time playing in the field, so it will be fun. So the equipment that I've got, I'll be bringing the sniper rifle. And my P piece is the handgun. It's not the revolver. It's not the Uzi. It's just the normal handgun. I have done an unboxing on that. So what I got from BB Gun for less is I actually went to the shop again because I feel like it's better. I got a mash mask. Now this mash mask is um the front bit's made out of Kevlar. The round bit. When you put it on, it doesn't. When you look down, it doesn't poke you in the chest, which is good. Like Norwich, he had to adjust his because it always poked him in the chest. But this one is just right. When I got this, I looked at two masks. One was a Terminator, which covered your whole face, not the back of your head, though. And then there was this one. This one was eight pound ninety nine, or twenty pounds. So I bought it, and then yeah. This is very nice, it has adjustable things on the back, it's got a nice, um, it's got a nice back here for the top of your head so it doesn't hurt too much. I did test shooting at it, it's pretty good, it's pretty hard. I show it, it did make a tiny little dent but you won't be able to see that if you're shooting. And this one, when you put it on and then you look down a scope with one eye, this the nose bit won't get in the way of your eye vision, so you'll be able to snipe. Um, this scope it curves, as you can see, it curves in and it comes out. It's very, it's very good. From this angle, you can see it's got like the leave pattern. It's got the camo, which isn't really good for the back bit. I, I. I would suggest trying to get one with a back bit, which is a um, thing as well, so you can camouflage them better. And let's put this on. So you can see my mouth and my nose. I normally have it down here, which is much better for me, because even when I'm sh looking down the site, just now I did just adjust my hop-up, and the um, I did just adjust adjust the um scope vision so yeah what i what you should i would recommend is getting some pair of goggles these ones are pretty sturdy i got these from a paintball shotgun i haven't done an unboxing on that sorry if i haven't i did i've got two paintball guns shotgun and one just like a small one these ones are pretty hard i shot my sniper rifle out a, which is 380 fps which is pretty good i normally use uh two gram point two gram bbs because they are like the best ones to use not too much weight and uh yeah sometimes i sometimes my vision is uh, a little like um limited because i might have to clean these a bit so yeah, I normally will have these on in case I get shot in the eye, which you do not want to happen, that's the worst thing. And what I did get from Primark, yes, I got this uh, camouflage hat. This uh, blends me well within the uh, app, within the field that I'm going to be playing in. So this is what I will be like. I kind of, I do kind of, you can still see my eyes, but that's not a problem. You, if you can no longer see like this bit, and then my head, you won't be able to see me properly. So, what I was thinking, let me just take this off. What I was thinking, the this thing does um, leave a bit of marks around your face, but that will just go away. What I was thinking on this was, on my eye vision, because I'm better located in this eye. This eye, I don't know why, but it's limited to vision not much i can see they for some reason i feel like they see the same but this one is like because it's got smaller eye vision thing. so this one here what i was thinking where it's located at my eye in the middle i was going to draw a little red dot so when i wanted to look at people and through my scope because my scope is the um plus sign one in the middle 
I was thinking of putting a little red dot in there so when I look down the scope it will uh, have a little red dot which is pretty good yeah so these ones are from like I just got these from a paintball gun uh, shotgun which uh, I got three of them because I got one paintball gun for my birthday and then my brother broke that one then I had to get another one for my other birthday so yeah and I got three pairs and you're wondering why the three one if you heard I did get another uh, paintball gun I can't remember it was only like a small one though this hat from Primark won't cost you very much it does have this sign but I am doubt anyone would like to see that um, this one costs three pounds very cheap it's very comfortable so if you get shot by a BB you're, it might hurt but not too much so yeah this is very comfortable and it can come all the way down here which is good because in case you get shot there which is pretty thing so yeah so and this thing here i think i don't know let me test it no you cannot i thought you could take this bit out there's a little back bit here i thought you could take it out but you cannot just to like measure where you want this to be so it can fit your um head shape I would, I would recommend though, this is a mash mask, it's like Novotich uh, one, um, I would recommend getting a full head one, I did see one with, um, it went all the way around your head and in the front, like all the way here, from down to here, was Kevlar, so that was pretty good, but I, I didn't have enough money for that, so yeah, so I'm going to be playing a match on the 3rd of February, I don't know where yet, but it is, um, I can't remember what it's called, but it's a pretty good website. You can be up to 12, which I am, which is pretty good, because in England, when we play Airsoft, we need to be at least over the age of 12. We can't, I don't know why, but we can't be below the age of 12. If we're 11, we're not allowed to play. I don't know why we have a BB gun. And because I'm 12, my dad, when he would be taking me, I need to sign a perm. He needs to sign a permit for me to play uh, airsoft, so which is pretty good. So yeah, I have got some new track um, tracksuit bottoms, which are green, so they're blending with the environment as well. I don't know. I might actually get some new uh, shoes as well because it said you need ones that are like water resistant and like mud, re like um, dirt, res dirt stuff and all of that and yeah so i might be getting a pair of them but i don't know about my uh coat because i did look at one in primark which was like it was eight to nine but my dad said it was too no it was eight nine to ten and my dad said it was too big me big for me but i felt like it was perfect but i need to like move around because i've got a sniper rifle coming on my back i need to be able to take it off and then use it yeah so that's what i need to do yeah so, and I don't know if I'm going to be putting like, you know, like make you um, face paint on your face, like Commando and all that around there, like what uh, Morrisic does, which is pretty good. You know, he was actually the one who inspired me to get one of these mash masks because he said these are like the best quality ones that you can get because they got hard Kevlar on it, and you can. Actually, you can actually put this into your shape, so when you want to put it in, you can bend it in a bit. But I don't know why you want to do that. It's perfect as the way it comes. Yeah, this I got from Ruby Guns for Less. Always go for that shop, because it's the best shop to go for. Let me just uh, put this up here. And at the back, let me just pick you up. So, hold on. At the back, you can see here which is uh, supported on the top of your head. So you wanna, might wanna put it down a bit, So, which is pretty good. But um, yeah, this ain't centered into the middle of my head. I've got a bit of hair hanging out there, but that don't matter. Just, uh, right. So yeah, that's uh, the back of it, which is pretty good. It comes all the way around here. If you had uh, bigger ears than me, you'd be able to um, put like these bits down. 
so look there you can put it down here but I can't because my ears ain't that big so yeah so yeah that is um BB Guns for Mask make sure you click like and subscribe and I'll uh, see you in the next video